Chances are, if you're watching this video, then you're thinking about signing up to the Glow Yoga app. So I hope to give you a little insight into what it's all about. I just finished a yoga every day for 30 days challenge where I did yoga every day for a month and I used the Glow Yoga app and I loved it. So I thought that I'd make a video review about it. And just a quick note before we start, this video isn't sponsored or endorsed by Glow. They haven't asked me to make it. I'm a member and have been paying for three months. I paid with my very own money. That's that bit out of the way. Let's get into the video. With COVID still lurking its ugly head in the world, that's when I decided to do 30 days of yoga and I knew that I needed classes to help keep me motivated. So I did a bit of research and I came across Glow and I'd never heard of them before. And the reason that I chose the platform was because I got 15 days free. I really liked the simple no fuss layout and also liked that there was a variety of classes with many different teachers, male and female, different skin colours, ages and body shapes. You can use the Glow platform on your laptop and also using the Glow app on your smartphone or your tablet. Most of what I'll show you today will be using the laptop because I enjoyed using mine just because it's a bigger screen and a bit more immersive, but I will also be showing you the Glow app for smartphone later on in the video. At the time of recording this video, there are 4,340 classes on the platform and 101 programs with more being added each week. And I'll explain the programs a little bit later on. The classes included are yoga, pilates, meditation, fitness, and there's an education section which includes lectures and courses. The majority of classes are yoga, ranging from absolute beginner to unbelievably advanced. I'll start by showing you the homepage. When you sign up and log in, you'll be brought to the For You page. Personally, I rarely use this. It shows classes that you might be interested in, popular ones and new classes. Then there's the search page and this is my favourite page. As if I've got a favourite page on Glow. This is where you can search for exactly what you want based on the mood you're in, length of time, the level, intensity, style of yoga, teacher you like, focus for the practice, body part you want to work, if you want props, music or live classes. Most of the time I can find a class that I want pretty quickly. What I like to do sometimes is spend some time scrolling through all the classes and finding the ones that I like and adding them to my library and my collections. A library is where you put all the classes you like or you want to do. And a collection is a group of classes collated by you. Glow also offer live classes and I have done a few, but generally they're at 4 p.m. and 10 p.m. UK time and I usually do my yoga in the morning. But I think all of the live classes get turned into on-demand classes. So if you do miss a live class, then chances are you can catch up with it later on. As mentioned earlier, there's all different styles and levels taught by various teachers. There are lots of beginner classes and I even made a collection of classes for my mum. And then there are the classes that are absolutely mega. Otherwise, keep the elbows oh, in. Are you joking me? Push up toward the scorpion, pause. I'll get involved and give them a good go, but mostly I end up in a heap on the floor. <laughs> <sighs> the main thing here is that there's something for everyone of all abilities and all levels and I love that. Begin to straighten your right leg as you bring your left arm across your head. The programs are really cool. They are a selection of classes, usually about 5 to 12 classes, concentrating on specific subjects. And now's probably a really good time to mention the Pilates classes. There's 162 classes and seven programs. And I've never really done Pilates before. I couldn't really get into it, but I've been doing one or two classes per week and I am really enjoying them, kind of. And I'm finding they're a really great tool to complement my existing training. 
I've done some of the fitness classes and currently there's only 19 of them on the platform but I really enjoyed what I did and I've done some of the meditation classes as well which there's 521. All of these numbers that I'm giving you probably when you come to watch this video there's going to be more just because there's videos being uploaded onto Glow every week. When it comes to equipment, most of the classes you don't need anything, you just need your mat. But there is the option to do some classes with things like blocks, a strap, some sliders and other bits and pieces. There is so much on the platform and there's never been a time where I can't find something that I really want to do. So with everything that I've showed you on the laptop, you can also do on the Glow app. You've got your search, you've got your library. The only difference between using Glow on your laptop and on your smartphone, and it is so cool, is that on the Glow app for your smartphone, you can download any of the classes so you can do them offline and you don't need to use any data. Very, very clever. Glow is $18 a month, which works out at about £14 per month if you live in the UK. And you do get 15 days free to try it out. I think the Glow Yoga app is amazing. Considering in London, a single yoga class can cost me between 15 and 20 pounds. I'm now paying 14 pounds a month and I'm doing about 25 classes a month. And I know it's not the same as being in a real life class, but with everything that's going on right now, it just makes sense for me to be at home, staying fit and healthy for only 14 pounds. As I sit editing this video, I've just thought of something else that I really want to share with you guys. is the fact that Glow offer lots and lots of mini classes, five to 15 minutes, which I think is amazing, especially right now when so many of us are working from home and probably not getting as much movement as we need. You can just go on, do a five to 10 minute class just to break up your day and just get a bit of circulation going. I've been editing this video for quite a few hours, so I definitely feel as though I need one right now. Even though my yoga every day for 30 days challenge ended 10 weeks ago, I loved it so much that I decided to keep my membership bowling and I'm still loving it. Honestly, this is one of the best purchases that I've made in a long time and I'm so grateful that I found it. So I'd say if you're thinking about signing up to Glow, then just 100% get stuck in, get involved and sign up to the 15 days free. And then if you love it, then it's really not going to break the bank. You can do it anywhere, anytime, and you've just got thousands of classes to choose from. And you're going to stay fit and healthy and have a healthy mind as a result. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you found it useful. And if you've got any questions about the Glow Yoga app, then please put them in the comments box. I really enjoy making videos about living a healthy and cheerful life. I do product reviews, challenges and adventures. So if you're interested in stuff like that, then consider hitting the subscribe button. I will put some other videos up on screen right now that I think that you might like. And thank you very much for watching.